<laughs> Getting to host the Rock and Roll Hall of Fame inductions every two years is a great opportunity that helps put our city in the spotlight. It certainly does. And over the years, the inductions have grown beyond measure. Fox 8 anchor Todd Meany is live at the Rock and Roll Hall of Fame with more on what we can expect this year. And Todd, if you've ever gone to an induction ceremony, there is nothing quite like it. That's got to be on everyone's bucket list. Mm, yeah. It is, and now being able to have it at Rocket Mortgage Fieldhouse is amazing. You know, they got the history of public hall. The Beatles were there when they shut the place down, you know, back in 64. But now to have it at Rocket Mortgage Fieldhouse, where the fans and more fans can be there to be a part of this and to have all these performers, it, it is going to be an experience. And it's, it's historical as well with a diverse group of inductees this year. Greg Harris, president and CEO of the Rock Hall, joining us now. Great to see you. How you doing? I'm doing fantastic. It's great you're mentioning Rocket Mortgage. I walked through last night. Oh, did you? Okay. And uh, the setup is just over the top. It is amazing. The venue looks terrific. Cleveland is no doubt going to shine this weekend, and we're so honored to bring all these people from around the world right here to Cleveland for the Rock and Roll Hall of Fame induction. We had Led Komorowski on earlier today, CEO of the Cavaliers and Rocket Mortgage. He was talking about the Power Portal, how that's all new. That's everything's digital, so they can really tailor it to what you guys want. Yeah, the, the all of Rocket Mortgage Fieldhouse. Well, it's the home of the Cleveland Cavaliers. It's going to look like it's the Rock and Roll Hall of Fame on Saturday night. So cool, so cool. And you have to be excited that it's there. I mean, I, I, I talked about public. Call that history that's there, but to be able to have it in a bigger venue with more fans being able to attend, it's going to be a rocket place. You're right. You know the energy from having twice as many people participate, but also, um, you know, in this era, safety, health is so important. Yep. Rocket Mortgage is set up for all of that, and Cleveland's going to shine to the world. What are you most excited about? I know it's a whirlwind kind of a weekend for you. You got to be overwhelmed with everything. But what are you most excited about on Sunday morning when you're like, boy, that was that was it. You know, we did it. Yeah. Um, what I'm most excited about is that we're going to fill every single hotel room in downtown Cleveland. Yeah. It'll be 22, 25,000 room nights total sold here, but that means it's people having great experiences. It's people loving it. And my moment isn't going to be Sunday morning. It's going to be Saturday night when the first notes are played. And I'm not going to look at the stage. I'm going to turn around and look at the audience and realize that all of these people are about to be connected by the power of rock and roll. It's so cool. And, th and we see that as people walk in the doors here, people who are coming from all over the world to see the Rock and Roll Hall of Fame induction ceremony, but to see the Rock Hall probably for the first time. I did watch some people come in and they just kind of awe, you know? And, and boy, you guys have really decked the Rock Hall out for this uh, weekend. You know, well, thank you. The, the building looks amazing. The team is doing an incre incredible job. This starts at the airport. Yep. It's all Rock Hall branded induction there. There's billboards, there's signs. You come into town, downtown is plastered with them. The, the Rock and Roll Hall of Fame looks amazing. We have volunteers that are helping with everything. The arena looks great. The hotels, we've decked out hotel lobbies. Oh, it, cool. We've taken over the city, but we've done it in a way that just welcomes everybody to Cleveland. And that's what, what Clevelanders do. We're a great host, and we can host world-class events in this city. What an evolution, though, from 1997, the first time it was here in Cleveland, uh, now six times here in the city of Cleveland. We love that it's coming back every other year. But to see that evolve, too, that has to be an interesting process. It really is. You know, you mentioned 97. That was held in a hotel ballroom. At the Renaissance, right? At the Renaissance, yeah. maybe a 1,000 people, maybe. Uh, we're going to host 12,000 people, and we're going to have people through this museum all day long, all weekend long. Right. Uh, artists are coming over, inductees are coming over. Somebody's cheering right now. I wonder who's here. Uh, and uh, media's everywhere. It's just a blast, and we love it. Boy, this is like our Super Bowl week for Cleveland. Might be some of the Go-Go's. They have the interview at noon today, and of course, we saw the preview of the, the uh, signature wall that's going in, and uh, it, it's going to be an incredible day. So thank you so much. Appreciate it. I know you got a lot to do, so I, thanks for taking some time to talk with us. It's my pleasure. Thanks, and uh, thank you to everybody in Northeast Ohio for helping us be a great host. We really appreciate it. Well, when you have Rock Hall, Destination Cleveland, Rocket Mortgage, all the, all the entities working together, it can only be a success. You nailed it. Thank Great, you. Thanks so much. All right, we'll send it back to you, Wayne, Steph. Take care. All right, Todd.